Hello again for another video. This time I'm going to be showing the new line of sight functionality I've added. Uh, most of the uh, interest on that will be up here in the upper left in the minimap area. You can see immediately that instead of seeing the entire map you now only have revealed these this small area of cells. That's what's currently in the line of sight of the party leader, which is the arrow. As I walk forward, you can see this grows. I can not only I can see additional areas, but I also once I explore a cell and move on, it remains revealed on the map. You can also see as I'm walking back and forth here that the grid cells that I am that are currently in the party's line of sight appear lighter in color, whereas grid cells the party has viewed previously but no longer have in line of sight have this gray shading. Something else you'll notice now is that whereas before all monsters were shown on the minimap all the time, I'm currently only allowing the player to see on the minimap monsters that are currently in line of sight. So these red dots will appear and disappear as that happens. And now I'll just navigate around this larger area to show how the uh, obstructions actually cast shadows in the line of sight. So this all looks pretty natural and what you'd expect if you were walking around walls and things you wouldn't be able to see what's on the other side of the wall of course so that's kind of neat now I'll move over and demonstrate this with some doors here I'm facing this iron door if I pop it open immediately we can see what's on the other side if we turn around and come back to the door now and close it can watch how, as you'd expect, what's on the other side of the door becomes grayed out and revealed again as I open and close the door. And this is also true for monsters. So that's a nice effect. All this line of sight stuff will make it possible to finally get to work on combat, which will be the subject of the next video. about the algorithms I used for the pathfinding and the line of sight tracing. There is a blog post that talks in detail about these algorithms, which you can find from the main site. And that's it. Thank you.